at least uh, 23 people dead, uh, more missing and injured, um, trees uh, uprooted, uh, houses uh, leveled, uh, search and rescue operations uh, underway. Um, as you mentioned, the uh, mayor of um, a small town called Rolling Fork, uh, just saying my city is gone. Um, that, that town appears to have been completely um, obliterated. Um, uh, extremely tough times and the, the, the state um, is mobilizing uh, resources to uh, begin the search for uh, survivors and in the longer term there'll be um, an attempt to, to, to rebuild. Um, it, appears to have been, it appears to have been uh, multiple um, tornadoes in this area and of course uh, very little um, warning for, for people. Um, you're seeing some uh, very grim footage um, on, on YouTube and elsewhere of uh, people's uh, homes lost and uh, cars overturned, uh, reports of debris flying uh, thousands of uh, feet um, in the air. Um, and as, uh, as is often the case we see with these um, extreme weather events, um, it's the, um, the people at the bottom of the social ladder who often uh, suffer the most. Uh, uh, questions here over uh, uh, excessive housing construction and some of it maybe not uh, not very solid and um, that has borne the brunt of uh, some of this uh, destruction um, a, a very difficult um, time uh, for, for the people in uh, in Mississippi and uh, neighboring states